Hello everybody, welcome to Project Beauty, where we talk about project panning and everything beauty related. My name is Jen. I'm going to be doing my finale today for 22 in 2022. The reason for that is most of the items that are left over in my project are summertime items and summertime is coming to a close. So I want to make sure I make room in my project pan area and little inventory area. Um, make room in there for, you know, new items that are coming into different projects that are coming up. So I'm going to close this down. Um, I will be sad to see some of these go back into my inventory, but at the same time, I know I can pull them out next year when summer comes around again. Also, if I really want to, I can self tan and I can use them in the wintertime as well. So let's go ahead and get started with the items that I'm going to be putting back. And I'll talk to you guys also about the amount of usage that I have. So the first item is my MAC Double Definition Highlighter and Bronzer Duo. And these are the shades right here. So we have the bronzer right here and the highlighter right here. These are very nice on my summer skin. They are not really good for my fall and winter skin. And as you can see, I'm getting slightly lighter, actually quite a bit lighter than I was in the summer, which is so sad. But at the same time, I know. And now I can use other things because I'm getting lighter. I can use the other items in my collection. But... This year, I've had a lot of really fun items to use being so tan, and I, I realized that I have a lot of summer shade items, so I need to work on those a lot in the summer and not go so lazy and not wear any makeup. It's not really about lazy, actually. It's more so that it's so hot, and I feel like the makeup is like melting off my face, so I tend not to wear makeup as much in the summertime as I do in the wintertime. So... This one will be going back, but out of the 20 uses I have, or sorry, out of the 20 use goal, I got 15 uses out of that. So I'm really proud of that. I think that's fantastic. But this one will be going back into my inventory. The next item is the MAC Azalea Blossom Blush. This was uh, a goal of 15 uses, and I actually reached that goal. But as you can tell, it's got some crazy hard pan and I had to scratch it and it's already getting more hard pan where I've had to scratch it off. So as much as I like love this, it's not something I enjoy using because of the hard pan and I have to keep scraping it off. But I'm not getting rid of this because it's really a beautiful shade. I'll see if I can get there. You can really see like my fingerprints and everything in there. But this is what the blush color is. It's really, really beautiful. So I'm not getting rid of that. I really do like that blush shade. So um, I reached my goal of 15 uses. It took me like eight months of the year to get this. Eight and a half actually. Um, but I'm still very happy that I used this 15 times. The next item is my Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer. This is the first one that ever came out. <laughs> it's old and the packaging I think does it it doesn't even clip closed anymore like it doesn't even stay closed so I'm probably going to get a new one because this is really old but for now I'm going to leave it in my collection until I get the backup it's gorgeous it's absolutely stunning I love the slight luminosity to it I love the shade it's beautiful for fall. I could probably continue to use this in the fall, but I am going to put it back because I'm working on a couple of other bronzers still. <laughs> so this one, this is what it looks like. And I wanted to use this a total of 10 times and I used it a total of eight times. So I've only had two, I could have used it today and got a ninth use, but I used something else. So Eight out of 10, I think that's really good. Uh, but this one will be going back into my collection. But I probably will declutter that eventually and replace that. But I have so much bronzer right now, I don't really need to do that. Um, the next item is another one that I hit my goal on. So this was the ColourPop Cherry Crush Eyeshadow Palette. So the Azalea Blossom Blush and this eyeshadow palette are the two that I was like, my goal was to reach the end goal. And I actually did that. So I wanted to use this five times this year and I managed to actually do that. Once I started using this, I didn't want to stop using it. It's really, really nice. I love every shade in here. And this Take a Bite shade is the best shade I have ever put on my eyes. I think almost ever, like as far as a matte raspberry shade goes, 
it's so beautiful oh my gosh i will swatch one more shade for you guys here just so you can have a little peek at what these colors look like but these are gen colors let me swatch that one again that was terrible so very very pretty that really bothers me the way that looks <laughs> okay so i'm gonna put that back in my collection i yeah like i said five uses and i managed to hit that and the next item is my um, Nicki Minaj perfume, which I have not weighed, so I will quickly grab my scale. But I'll show you, this is what she looks like. And I was able to make another line. I put tape over it because otherwise the lines wear off from me grabbing it. But this bottom line is where we're at. Um, I'm trying to use like perfume samples and my other perfume that I want out. Um, so it looks like we were at 146.99 and we're now at 145.17. I am going to grab a pen and write that down. Sorry, I'm very ill prepared right now. But 145.17. Um, of course, I did not complete this and we started off at 151. So we used a pretty good amount. Um, I'm okay not completing this. I really love this perfume and I can't find um Nicki Minaj Onika which is what this perfume is or um Menajesty Menajesty I think that's what it's called I did find Pink Friday so I got one of those it's a 50 ml perfume I did pick that up and I wish I could find her other ones they're really really nice and really inexpensive it was 20 bucks for 50 ml of perfume and I really enjoy it but it's probably because it's older anyhow long story short that is going back into my collection and I will use that in a future project so I'm just happy to get some use on it honestly I don't have that many perfumes left because I have been plowing through them and I definitely put a lot of perfume on because I find that the perfumes that I use don't really last throughout the day uh, so and I, I like to smell them so I put like four spritzes on and it'll be strong for a second and then as I get outside to get to my vehicle or walk outside at work it kind of dissipates and then I'm like I smell nothing so that's when I bring my little minis and then I use those at the end of the day so then I have something else to refresh so I'm definitely getting a lot of use on my perfumes which is really nice um, so the next two items and the last two items we have are these little buggers right here you guys know these single eyeshadows are barely getting any use for me so the first one we'll talk about is Smoky Mauve. I wanted to use this 20 times, okay? That shouldn't be that difficult for a beautiful purple shimmery eyeshadow, but I have only used it three times because I have so many beautiful purple eyeshadows in palettes and stuff that I just don't grab towards singles anymore. And then this one is Sweet Heat, which is absolutely stunning. So what I might do is disinfect these and take off the top layer and I might put these in my kit because they are very beautiful and would be really nice for like bridal makeup so I might do that or I might hang on to them and try and use them because I have used quite a bit of it like you can see it's kind of starting to wear down on this one but I think the purple one was used more previously I can't tell now that one's got a lot more I don't know <laughs> I don't know anyhow they're very beautiful but the steam no steam heat sweet heat i wanted again to use 20 times and i used that one nine times i don't think i used them at all last month i think those are the same totals as the last update and i'm just i'm not wanting to update no uses like i already have so many things in projects where there's no uses because there's so much stuff in in other projects and things that i'm not even using so they're just kind of sitting there so to alleviate some of that not stress but like there's so much to look at it's kind of it's not like super overwhelming I know it's there it's just I don't want to grab towards it so that should really sorry I have like an itchy nose I think I have a brush hair somewhere oh my gosh anyway I just don't know like when I look at something like for example this one I would much rather use like this yeah I can feel that hair I would much rather use something like this in a palette even though it's not as pretty but because it's within the palette I would rather 
use it. So um, singles like that that are subdued are not exactly something that I grab for. So I think I really have to take note of that and either try to depot them and put them in like single format with my other ones so that I can use them when I want to use them. That's really annoying. I'm sure it's annoying for you guys too. I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just have to take a little bit more note on the way that I'm using my products. But I am excited to see that I love my Azalea Blossom Blush. I love the bronzer and the highlighter and the butter bronzer. And I love the Cherry Crush thing. These are the only two that I'm not digging. So I may actually part with those. But seeing Sweet Heat on here, it just... It's just so pretty, but on the eye, I feel like it is absolutely nothing. So I think I may part with those. Um, so we'll see. We'll see if you, if I do a declutter in the future, you guys should be able to see those in there. Uh, but I will definitely keep you posted. So that's everything. That's the only items I have left. I have completed 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 goals. And of course I have... That sounds wrong. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> I have seven items out here. So, oh yeah, and the perfume. I'm counting six in front of me and I'm like, that sounds wrong, but I put the perfume back already. So I feel like that's really good and I got some use on these items. So if I keep doing that through the years or maybe decluttering things like, for example, this one and just using the other bronzers that I have, that would be, oh my gosh, that would be three items that I have out of this project. Um, not just because of getting to use them, but also I'm realizing that it's not something that I grab. So I feel like this is a success in itself, um, hitting that many goals and also finding stuff out about my collection. I feel like stuff like that is super successful. So I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this. I know this is not the most exciting update, but thank you so much for sticking around and I will talk to you guys again in the next one. Bye everyone.